Hey guys, welcome to Indie Game Hustle. My name is Charles. Um, real quick, in this video, I wanted to make a really quick update to our last video where uh, we were making, um, setting up the notification basically for whether you're using joystick or keyboard. Now in the part where it says trigger, um, before if you look inside the conditions, I have some additional things down here. Um, this is pretty much like else. And I realized, of course, I do not need this. And so I think that may have been something I was testing at the time, but I tested it and it seems like it's not necessary here. So what you can do is go into your conditions. If you did set it up like mine, um, you really only need the if and then then here. OK, you will not need necessarily anything underneath here. So um, what I'll do is just go ahead and go into conditions and I would say go to the plus uh, the X and just kind of delete those and then I will go in here and get rid of the action that is empty as you can see there and just hit delete and then I'll do the same thing for this condition as well um, so what I would do is just hit that and hopefully this is indeed uh, the case on all of them I'll just hit delete and I'm just going to do that on every single one. And I just wanted to make sure that we're all on the same page, just in case you are following along that closely. Um, and I'll go ahead and hit delete there. And I will go into these conditions and hit rid of it. Because I want to show um, pretty much every step as much as possible um, with this. I don't want to skip anything or anything like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of those, get rid of that unnecessary action. And we're going to do the same thing for uh, the keyboard. So go ahead and go to conditions and get rid of those. I really believe that this is not necessary. And I'll go to the conditions of this one. And I will get rid of these actions here, which is empty, as you can see. Conditions, delete, or get rid of these extra ones at the bottom. Go down here and just hit delete on this action. Got just two more left. And I'll just get rid of these. Whoops. Get rid of this. And then delete this. And then the last one. And we'll test it. I'll test it right now and, and just make sure that indeed that is something we don't need. Um, and then I'll just go ahead and hit that. Boom. So now let's just confirm <laughs> that all of that was indeed working. All right. So I'm going to get rid of whatever's going on there. All right. Great. So. Obviously, uh, this is the keyboard. All right, so if I pick up the controller and I hit the jump button, the joystick is alive, great, uh, that's working. If I go back to the uh, mouse and attack, keyboard is active. And if I hit another button, like crawl, the joystick is active, get back up, we're good to go. All right, perfect, guys. All right, I just wanted to show you that you didn't see that bottom part, and uh, great. All right, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. For the next set of videos, I'll be releasing one every day at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. So, to stay up to date on the latest 3D platforming tutorial, feel free to subscribe to the channel. If you'd like to support, you can find me on Patreon, or, of course, you can hit me up on Discord. I like to talk about whatever project you guys are working on. Of course, thanks for hanging with me. Your support is always appreciated. As always, remember, never give up and keep moving forward. Peace.